Hey guys, this is Thor with Schrock Innovations. We've been getting a lot of calls in the service center recently about a program called Malwarebytes. They recently came out with a new version, and in the new version, it pops up a little message in the lower right-hand corner of your screen that looks a lot like this. It says, do you want your premium trial to continue? Your premium trial's expired, and you have three options. None of the options are, hey, don't ever bother me again. And as a result, no matter what you click on this, unless, of course, you know, you take the top one here and spend the money, um, you're going to get this pop-up two or three times a day, and it's really, really annoying. Now, it used to be in the Malwarebytes settings right over here, you could actually turn off this notification. There was a little button here that said uh, start Malwarebytes when Windows starts up. They've removed that option now, and uh, now you can't turn it off. So whether you wanted Malwarebytes to run every time your computer starts or not, it does. Now, obviously, Malwarebytes wants to be an antivirus program. That's what they're trying to do. But I already have great antivirus. I've got Semantic Endpoint. I'm good to go. So I don't want Malwarebytes even running all the time on my computer. So the question is, number one, how do I stop it from running? And number two, how do I get rid of those annoying pop-ups? So we're going to show you how to do that today. So now down here, if you go to the lower left-hand corner and you right-click on your Start menu, when you right-click, you get more options. So once you right-click, I'd like you to go up to the Task Manager right here and then left-click on Task Manager. Right-clicking gives you more options. Left-clicking makes a selection. So now across the top of the Task Manager, there are a series of tabs here. We're looking for the Startup tab right here. So we click Startup, and if you click on the word name here, you can actually sort this list by name, which makes life really easy because you can find Malwarebytes really quickly. Now, as you can see on my computer, I've already disabled Malwarebytes, and that keeps it from starting up when my computer starts. That's why we disable it. So I'm just going to enable it here just so I can show you how to do it. You right-click anywhere on this selection, and then you left-click on Disable. And now you'll notice here it says Disable. So when you restart your computer now, Malwarebytes will be disabled and your computer will be able to, you can run Malwarebytes anytime you want and if you ever want it to go away to stop popping up, all you have to do is restart your computer to get it to stop again. Alright, well if you liked the video, give us a review on Google or Facebook, let us know. If there's anything we can do different, let me know as well and we'll see you soon.